Good morning and welcome to 9-11 Experiments. Experiments you can do at home, even in your kitchen, to help prove or disprove the official conspiracy theory of the 9-11 Commission, which proves what really happened on September 11, 2001. Now, one of the theories advanced by Dr. Zdenek Bezant of Zdenek Bezant is a professor at Northwestern University. In his paper, Why Did the World Trade Center Collapse? A simple analysis, and which was cited by in the NIST report, is that the top floors of the World Trade Center acted as a pile driver on the floors below, going all the way to the bottom, pancaking down. Now, since pancakes are Made from, uh, made from eggs, we'll use them as a model of the floors of the World Trade Center. And each of these eggs will be like a floor. Well, I don't have 110 of them, but this will give you the idea. And on September 11th, we saw the top 10 or 12 floors, represented by this egg, falling down to the floors below and continuing all the way to the bottom. Now, the truth movement says that only the falling egg and the top egg or egg would sustain equal damage and that the bottom floors would be undamaged. So let's give this a try. Let's show. So I'll hold the egg much higher than the 10 floors would be to give it a little added impact. And egg away. Now. Only the top egg cracked, and there's a crack on the second egg. The other eggs are not damaged at all. Hmm, how can that be? Let me try, try another egg. Okay, this will do it. All the way, to, this is going to go all the way to the bottom. Here we go. Hmm. The bottom eggs are still undamaged. It seems to need an external pile driver to collapse the bottom egg all the way to the bottom. Hmm. Well, apparently much more weight is needed and it needs to have sustaining downward pressure or some explosive to weaken the bottom floors. So it seems like this experiment, uh, Dr. Bizant and I have egg on our face. So let's try another experiment. Well, no use letting some good eggs go to waste. Good. Got a few eggshells in it though. 